How to set up the Aquila Pro AI Smart Mesh Router. Welcome to Aquila Pro AI. Let's set up your Smart Mesh Router. Before we start setup, you will need a D-Link account, the Aquila Pro AI app, internet service, and a modem. If you don't have the Aquila Pro AI app in your phone, you can download it from the App Store or Google Play. Once done, you are ready to start setup. The Aquila Pro AI M30 includes one or two devices, depending on the package you purchased. There is also a QIG, power adapter, and ethernet cable for each device. The placement of the router is crucial. Place your device near your modem. Avoid placing it in enclosed areas such as a closet, cabinet, attic, or on top of other electronic devices. Well, also not inside, of course. We made the M30 beautiful, so you'll want to keep it out in the open. Now, connect an ethernet cable from the modem to the internet port of the M30. Next, connect the power adapter to the M30 and plug it into a power outlet. If it doesn't power up, make sure the power button on the back of the M30 is in the on position. Launch the Aquila Pro AI app, tap Install New Device, and scan the installation QR code at the bottom of the router. Follow the on-screen steps to complete the setup. How to set up the Aquila Pro AI Smart Mesh Extender E30. Welcome to Aquila Pro AI. Let's set up your E30. Install the free Aquila Pro AI app available on the App Store or on Google Play. Aquila Pro AI E30 package contents include a Wi Fi range extender, QIG, and Ethernet cable. Make sure your router is set up and connected to the internet. The E30 should be close to your router for setup. Launch the Aquila Pro AI app from the home screen of your device. Tap Install New Device. Scan the setup code on the side of the extender. Simply follow the on-screen instructions to complete the installation and configuration process. Confirm the Aquila Pro AI Mesh Network listed on screen is what you want to extend and then tap Extend to move to the next step. If the network you want to extend is not listed, you can connect your mobile device via Wi-Fi to the network you want to extend to make it appear. There are two options to extend your existing Wi-Fi network. You can choose wireless or wired connection. To utilize E30 with a mesh network, let's choose wireless connection. Plug the E30 into a power source near your wireless router and wait for the LED status to start breathing orange. Note, you will move the E30 to its final location in a later step. Your E30 LED should be breathing orange before continuing with the configuration. Wait for the connection. If connection fails, please connect your mobile device's Wi-Fi setting to the Wi-Fi network showing on the app. When you are ready, tap I have connected. Waiting for the setting to be applied, tap sync to start. Check out the extender placement tips. Place the extender in a centralized location within your desired usage area and keep minimal obstructions between it and the router. Also place it far away from cordless telephones, microwaves, and televisions to reduce any interference. 
When your extender LED turns solid white, it means the E30 is successfully connected to your existing network. If the LED shows breathing orange, it means it was unable to connect. Please move closer to your router and try again. You can now move your extender to a location halfway between your Aquila Pro AI router and the area where you need a stronger Wi-Fi connection. Make sure the LED remains solid white for a reliable Wi-Fi connection. If not, move it closer to the router. Done! Grab a drink and enjoy watching streams or making video calls in your favorite spot of the house. How to set up Mesh Wi-Fi System Okay, let's say that you now want to set up a mesh Wi-Fi system. To do that, you just need to tap the Install New Device button. Scan the QR code on the back of your device and choose to set up the device as a range extender. Tap Extend. Choose the way you prefer to extend your Wi-Fi, then tap Select. In this case, we will choose Wirelessly. Please move your device closer to your router. Note, you will move the device to its final location in a later step. Tap Next, then power on your device and tap Next. Make sure the LED is breathing orange and tap LED is now breathing orange. Please wait while your router and satellite power on. When the app prompts that Aquila Pro AI wants to join your Wi-Fi network, tap Join to Connect. Tap Sync. Give some time for the syncing to be completed. Check the device placement tips. For the best result, Aquila Pro AI units should be placed in an open, unobstructed area and away from electronics. When the LED turns solid white, tap Next. Unplug the device and place it halfway between your Aquila Pro AI router and the area where you need a stronger Wi-Fi connection. If the LED is solid white, when you plug the device into the spot you've chosen, it is ready to use. If the LED is breathing orange, try to move your device closer to the router. Tap Next. Tap Finish. Tap Join to reconnect your mobile device to your mesh Wi-Fi system, and you are done. You have completed the Aquila Pro AI Mesh Wi-Fi setup. Now you can enjoy whole home Wi-Fi coverage. How to configure parental control on the Aquila Pro AI Smart Mesh Router. Now it's time to show who's the boss. With parental control, you can set rules to control content and online access for your kids. You can simply tap the Start button or follow the instructions from the step-by-step -step setup tutorial video. First, tap the Add icon to create a profile to manage your clients. Enter a cool profile name and choose the clients you want to apply to this profile. Then tap the Done button to continue. Okay, this is your command room. Here you can pause the internet with powerful tools, including Schedule. Regulate network unavailability for specific time slots. Website filter. Block access to particular websites. You can also edit the lists of your clients. On the profile page, you can pause users' devices immediately and edit pop-up denied messages when they try to access the internet during regulated hours. Tap the preview button and complete the setup. Control of your kids' internet connection is in your hands. Let them discover a safer digital world with less worry. How to configure health mode on the Aquila Pro AI app. Five more minutes! That's a classic answer when you tell kids to go to sleep. 30 minutes pass and they are still there watching cartoons on the phone. You can create a healthier lifestyle for your kids by activating the health mode feature to completely turn off Wi-Fi connectivity or set a bedtime schedule to experience deeper rest during the night. Health mode was designed to help you adopt healthier internet habits so you and your family have a more calming bedtime routine and better night sleep. How to configure voice control on your Aquila Pro AI Smart Mesh Router. Are your fingers feeling lazy or are your hands busy cooking? Tap the voice control icon to enable voice commands for your Aquila Pro AI device with Google Assistant or Amazon Echoes Alexa. 
You are now ready to control your Aquila Pro AI device using your voice. Test this out by giving commands such as enable my guest Wi-Fi, update my router software, and reboot my router. Experience the convenience of voice control for a simpler life. How to configure guest Wi-Fi on the Aquila Pro AI Smart Mesh Router. Want to enable or disable guest Wi-Fi? No problem. Tap the Wi-Fi icon and turn on the guest Wi-Fi to complete the setup. Don't worry, your personal data is secure when providing internet access with friends and family. If you need more options, tap the settings icon on the top right. Enabling guest Wi-Fi lets you create a welcoming environment for your guests while helping to keep your network more secure. How to configure client priority on your Aquila Pro AI Smart Mesh Router. Okay, let's say you want to ensure that your video call can perform without hiccups. Client priority enables uninterrupted network services for preferred connected devices. For example, I set Alex's iPhone to high priority for four hours, so Alex can get the highest bandwidth possible for his video call and then stream his 8K movie with no lag or congestion. The red bar on the left of the client device indicates a heavy user. You can easily allocate bandwidth by simply assigning device priority from the app. Powerful tools to customize your connection are now in your hands. Make good use of them. As someone once said, with great power comes great responsibility. For more information on the Aquila Pro AI app, please visit www.dlink.com.